So the holidays are coming up, and my family has requested that I make my signature collard greens, so I figured I'd show you exactly what I use. You're going to need chicken broth, chicken bouillon, green seasoning, goya salad and vegetable seasoning, a smoked turkey drum, rice vinegar, as well as liquid smoked crushed red pepper, fresh garlic, and additional meat of your choice. I chose smoked neck bones, as well as some chopped garlic, some habaneros, and some onion. Once you have all your ingredients, go ahead and find the biggest pot that you have and add your chicken stock and some water to it. And because I don't want my greens salty, I'm just going to add one packet of the Goya salad and green seasoning, as well as one tablespoon of the chicken bouillon to start. I'm then going to add my crushed red pepper, add as much as you like, as well as as much garlic as you like. I like a lot of garlic, so I'm going in on how much I'm adding. You're then going to add a generous portion of the green seasoning. I say about a third of the bottle. You're going to give that a good stir and let that steep for a bit. And then you're going to add your rice vinegar. You're going to add some liquid smoke. Then you're going to add your smoked turkey drum and other smoked meats of choice. You're then going to add a few cloves of garlic as well as some diced habanero peppers and let that boil. Go ahead and add your chopped onions to the mix. Add as much of that as you want as well. You're gonna let this all boil for about 30 to 40 minutes to get the meat all nice and tender. And then you're gonna go ahead and prep to add your greens. For this batch of greens, I will be adding about four bunches of collards. So for this first go round, I'm just adding it to the broth and I'm gonna let it soften and boil down. Then I'm gonna come back and just add more. For my greens, I like to add mustard greens just for a little razzle dazzle. I like the peppery flavor of mustard greens, so I just like to add a little bit to my collards just for a little bit of mix. So every 10 minutes, you're gonna come back and check the greens, just smash them down and make sure that the liquid is saturating all of the greens and that your meat is still covered. Let that steep down for about 30 to 40 minutes, then go ahead and check on your meat and see if it has began to fall off the bone. When you begin removing the meat from the bone, be sure to remove any other bones that comes from off the drumstick. You should do this maybe about two to three times and just to check thoroughly for any remaining bones. There will be plenty, so just go in and remove any of the fat and the jiggly skin as well as the shards of bone that may have come from the drumstick. This is what your final result should look like. Go ahead and let that boil down a little bit more, but this tastes even better um, on day two. But yeah, this is it. Your meaty, spicy collard greens.